people welcome back to another no money spit video this is gonna be probably i think one of your favorite things we do on the channel we're gonna be taking a look at collections updates of course of course we've been playing a lot we've been grinding some stuff i'm gonna show you what i've been doing and we got a bunch of packs okay and i know you all love to watch me open packs and have a horrible time because so well actually you know hmm my luck's been pretty good until the last like two okay maybe maybe i'm done for the year there's no good luck anymore i don't even know but we're gonna open a bunch of packs and hopefully you enjoy it so we've been grinding a bunch of stuff they had the team mexico stuff they had a lot of content they have dropped over the past weeks i have pretty much completed everything but the charisma series stuff now the reason i haven't done it yet is because i just need to use some of these charisma uh relievers i just need to use them in ranked that's really the only spot i can use them unless they come out with more uh conquest maps which where are the conquest maps i'm just usually we have more whenever we get into more ranked we'll probably use some of these so we can knock this out so we can at least get the semen demon and then get luis castillo so i'm not really worried about that at all the mexico city stuff i actually just completed on stream here we have all these cards and we also got like the around the world three pack we've gotten a couple re uh, from the re-rolls we've gotten a couple of those packs as well you'll see and then april tops now we're completely caught up uh i don't know why it says i have 102 stars but right here it says i have 98 i don't know what the number is but we've completed that as well and in battle royale i've actually been playing a lot like i haven't really done well i'm gonna be honest with you i'm playing like ass but i have 140 battle royale stars or points whatever you want to call it and i only need eight more to get this 20 bundle and i got 14 days to do it so i mean i got this 10 bundle i got all the stuff leading up to it so uh, we've been we've been grinding we've busting our ass getting the re-roll rewind thing uh from the set one program as well to give you an idea i'm already at a i'm at 1,459,000 now keep in mind something i always want to make sure i stress this if you're not as far as me do not feel bad there's no wrong way to play a if you're enjoying yourself who gives a damn but b we all have different lives some of you guys have nine to fives maybe you go to school you have your wife and kids whatever you can't play as much as me i totally understand that's why i don't do any like flips i haven't invested in any of the live series updates for for market stuff uh any of that so that's just because i like to not i, I don't want to have all the easy stuff too where i can flip and stuff and i play a lot blah, blah 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 there's little ways that you can work the market for yourself and do things for you that if you want to catch up a little bit spend your time how you want don't feel bad if you're not as far as me or if you're farther than me you're a freaking you're a king love yourself i don't know team affinity update i am completely done with every single one of them except for the al central i have one more effing pack to go so that'll happen just by playing and using cards from the white Sox, the uh, guardians the tigers royals and twins i guess you could say i'm uh pretty dang ready for good old set two to come out all right now keep in mind when set two comes out you will still be able to use set one cards and core cards set three is when you won't be able to use set one so you don't feel like oh my gosh my binder's about to disappear it's definitely not definitely not so the amount of packs i have acquired here is 85 show packs nine ball is a habit we got the silver pack our scouting report we got a bunch of diamond duo and then i do have a boss pack that i got from a re-roll i don't know that's pretty cool and then uh we have the pack three around the world i have five of these that's a lot yes it is i opened one in the last video or the video before that i don't know I, I they all blend together now so that's a lot so we have five of those so we have five potential chances to get like 74k cards that's pretty nutty i would really like to get this jt uh real mudo card because it would be just fun to use and if i can just get him and then if i don't like him sell him you know it's nice to have options to show you where i'm at in collections too because we're gonna open stuff and then we're gonna see how we do i told you i was being lazy about tampa well we have totally done it super simple they're not hard to get anyway carlos pena has been unlocked he's ready to go i told you the mariners i was being cheap and i was just being lazy as well i've done them they're completely gone now the yankees i only need one card left and it's aaron effing judge so hopefully we pull him i don't know he's expensive as hell the rangers i need one more card and that's jacob effing de Gram. he too is expensive and then the angels did i say rangers last time or angels rangers now angels bam i have 37 out of 40. what the hell who am i missing oh i'm missing i'm missing chad wallach because he's a bronze one for 700 no thank you i will try to pack him he's new to the game and andrew velasquez 51 you know what i'll spend the 51 stubs call me tell me i'm flipping out the stubs like it doesn't matter let's go baby anyway 38 i need uh wallach and i need shohei expensive so maybe we can pack somebody to help us out that'd be really cool but let's open these and of course we're also gonna be grinding a lot more rank coming up uh especially on the twitch streams i stream pretty much daily check me out i'm usually live at night uh around 9 p.m 10 p.m eastern that's usually the goal might be a little bit late sometimes but usually that's when i'm live that link is in the description below all right let's get to it 
85 show packs baby um dude whenever the picture loads in late usually like right here hold on why is perdomo a 63 going for 110 hold on hold on yo perdomo's having a hell of a year oh my god he's hitting 383 with two bombs and he's already accumulated 1.5 war on the season is 192 ops plus and a 1.073 ops when did this happen yo my bad diamondback fans i was unaware of your boy shoot i might keep him he might go up we keep rolling we keep rolling baby got a gold it's kevin gossman and he's a supercharged boy i have three of them so i will go through and clean up my binder i've been kind of hesitant with that you might be going hey dimu last time uh, we got our boy Jesus. Let's go. You're like, last time you had about 100K, what did you do with the stubs? When the flash sale happened on last Friday, I noticed that uh, with the packs they were releasing, the Kyle Tucker 99 went way down in price. I bought him for 40K. To give you an idea, he's already back at 70K. So I figured I would buy him cheap, see if I like him. And if I sell him, I'm gaining stubs technically. That's kind of the first time I've ever really gained stubs by selling something, for being honest. So. I felt like it was a no-brainer. Christian Javier, the gold. Okay, we'll take it. Uh, Bailey Falter. Yep, that's exciting. Jared Schuster, our boy. Long live Jared Schuster. Gavin Sheets, not exactly ideal. 70. Ooh. Ooh. I saw an Angels hat, and I got really excited thinking I might pull the, the expensive dude, but nope. I got Daniel Vogelcock. Let's go. I got a chase pack. I'm going to tell you what. If your boy pulls Tatis, I don't have pants on right now. I'm just being truthful. I don't know what I'm going to do. I can't stand up. I don't have pants. I don't have pants. 73 packs remain, baby. Come on, give me some fire. Logan Allen is not going to tickle my pickle. We need something delicious, nutritious. Tyler Anderson. Oh, <laughs> that's not exciting. Come on, baby. Bam. Zach Eflin. That's exciting. Cool, cool, cool. Silvers all day. That's what I love. Yuri Rodriguez. All right, here, here's the thing. I got to explain something about our boy here. I like his glove. It's unique. It's different. I like the color scheme. I'm a big fan. I'm a big fan. I like it when players have like equipment that kind of flashes some personality i like it i'm a big fan bam we did get a silver it's cody ballinger who's having a killer year by the way come on baby show me something it's that god dang green screen for the effing athletics come on bam gregory soto i think he's been relatively solid to start the year hasn't he i think i think unless i'm tripping wander franco there's a gold okay where's the diamonds baby jake mccarthy honestly if we pull something out of the chase pack it won't even really honestly matter because like if I if I pull diamonds and stuff, you know what I mean? Like if I pull the Tatis, I won't give a damn if I pull any diamonds in these regular show packs all day, every day. But you got to think I'm going to at least get one or two, right? Am I just am I just assuming the pack luck's always good? You got to think two, right? That's fair. I don't know. We did pull Bubba Thompson there. I did see that. He's a king. God bless him. Long live our king. If you know, you know. Come on, baby. Also, since pack videos and nobody spent and all that good stuff, if you're watching this and you're like, hey, man, I enjoy this. Do me the biggest favor and leave a thumbs up on the video. It helps me more than you know. It helps me fight the YouTube algorithm. Look at the mustache on Scott Alexander. Good Lord. That is a fuzzy caterpillar. Anyway, leave a like on the video and of course, subscribe. We just hit 150,000 subs, which is an insane amount of subs. I really do appreciate you and I love you. Drew Maggie, 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 this guy, 13 year minor league player, got called up, got his first hit, and then he got a double the next day. Pretty cool story. I like it. Let's go. Keep going. Give me fire, John. I don't give a damn about you, son. Come on, Anthony Airbender and Michael Pineda doing some weird stuff with his tongue. Did I, did I just pull a Yankee State? What the hell? That's not the diamond I'm looking for, man. And we got a dude named Bubic that rhymes with pubic. Come on, Dylan Coleman. I like his glove too. I like the laces. I'm sorry. Am I a bitch for gloves? I don't know. Maybe. Bam. Zach Eflin again. Golly dang. I'll tell you what. Craig Kimbrell on school photo day. I like that. Thank you. Thank you. What's next? Bam. Nick Fortes. That's not exciting in the slightest. Bam. Tanner Bibby. Yo, he's playing to a 76 today. This dude is expensive. He was just added. We got our boy Sergio Romo. Long live our king. We love him. Friend of the channel. Yo, I meant to pick up Bibby in fantasy and I, I, I somebody beat me to him. Gallegos. Okay. Getting a gold. Maybe we're heating up. Maybe this is where we start finding. Nope. Josh Harrison. That's fucking upsetting. Come on, baby. Adam Wainwright. God dang. I tell you what. <sighs> Nick Gordon. That doesn't tickle my pickle. Come on, baby. I'm looking. Kyle Wright. Man, these packs have not been kind to me. Otto Lopez. I only have 38 packs left, bro. At this point, if I see one diamond, I might feel alive. Oscar Colas, who I'm a big fan of. Bryce Terang. Pulling a lot of young players. Come on, man. Give me something. I got Joey Krebio. Yep, I can read. Let's go. 35 packs. 
I need something, man. Brendan Donovan. These dudes have like too similar of a, of like a, like a, like a, like a, they got the hair coming out behind the ear and like they're both holding the bat. I thought I double dipped. I didn't. They're different. Here we go. Bam. Chase. Don't give a damn about you, Chase. Even if we don't really pull anything though, honestly, the fact that we're getting a bunch of dupes here and stuff is pretty nice. Uh, we can always Sean Murphy, who's been absolutely insane, insane. Long live the Atlanta Brave legend. We're pulling stuff that uh, could help us. You know, we're just going to go through, clean the binder, sell everything, find some stubs where maybe we can buy something. I was hoping we can pull some stuff, though, of, of, of notable value. I don't know if we're going to get that lucky, though. Hunter Harvey, that doesn't that doesn't do anything for me. Come on, baby. Bam. Drew Smith and Austin Slater. Oh, hail to the yeah. Come on. Who was the silver? Miles Straw. Are you pumped? Did you leave a like from Miles Straw? This Miles Straw. What about Zach? But he, but he spells Zach Z A K. I've never seen that in my life before, but that's Zach Kent. All right, there you go. All right, cool. What else we got? Bam, Sam, ugh, Tom Murphy. Oh, dude, give me something, please. God, Anthony Rendon. Jesus, man. Okay, you know what? I'm not allowed to complain. I know somebody's going to be like, Demu, you really shouldn't be able to complain about pack luck because you've had really good pack luck all year. And that's fair. You know what? I tip my hat. We do also have some packs where we get massive value we do a ball and it's a habit pack coming up we do have uh the chase pack we pulled i'd love to pull another chase pack if we're gonna matt olson he's been awesome we love him come on baby bam colton welker it's claudio new no i don't think he is didn't i didn't i just buy maybe i just no i, I don't know has alex claudio been in the game he used to be actually really good in br like back a couple years ago alex claudio was a amazing low round pick for br because he was just funky as shit sinker change up slider i don't know i think it was his motion i don't know he was funky i don't think i'd touch him this year though maybe i would i don't know salvador perez is the gold we got and these show packs have been brutal brutal dude good lord nothing oh shoot okay all you had to do was tell the packs that they're bad you just had it's purple it's it's effing purple that's not the crumb internet oh who do we get come on who do we get Oh wait. Oh, you're a you're a beautiful cell. Are you still worth anything? Oh, don't hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Hold on. God bless. Don't nope. Nope. Hold on. Gotta come over. Yeah, dude. Nah, we're gonna we're gonna come on here, little buddy. 33k. You know what? I think I will. Wow. Okay. Nice. I'll tell you what, if you're gonna give me purple diamonds, give me Fernando Tatis all day, man. That dude sells for 30K. I like it. All right. I also realized I have another one of these and he's going for 2,500 right now. Ooh, he could go diamond though. You know what, dude? Just take the stubs. Just take the stubs. Why risk it for a biscuit? You know what I'm saying? Anyway, back to the packs. Gimme, gimme. 14 show packs remain. Maybe we were heating up. I don't know. Two silvers? Not, I don't know if this is a common thought or an uncommon thought okay hunter brown i mean not hunter brown the houston astros jerseys the the city connect i actually liked them i mean i don't know if i really care about the space city thing but it's kind of dope at the same time but also the color scheme looks good i don't know i kind of like it maybe i'm alone here what was that dude named lock st john who the hell is that all right matt foster kyle muller braves legend looked super sad he couldn't stand in front of an iron green screen well hold on a minute what the hell is carlos perez doing this dude doesn't even have a green screen. What happened here? How does this work? He's wearing an Oakland hat. It was clearly Oakland picture day. I'm gonna tell you what, this, this Oakland photo day, the, the, the wormhole is, it's expanding. It's expanding and I need answers and I won't rest until I get them. Bruised Dark Ratterall. I think he had a really good first month, didn't he? I think, anyway, bam, Grayson Rodriguez. He throws gas. Uh, Seven show packs for Mame. I mean, we got Tatis. That's kind of cool. You know, like, like the shitty one. He's 30K. It's kind of cool. We got John. He looks happy to be here. Brandon Marsh. Looks like he might be related to me. And Jacob Lemon. Lemme, lemme, lemon, lemon, lemon. Yeah, that guy. Show packs keep going, baby. Come on. Bam, nothing. I got Yanni or Yoni and Kurt. Hell yeah. Four packs remain, baby. Steven Matz, look at the mustache on JP France. I don't know if I like JP France. He just gives me a look like he's gonna steal my kidney. All right, here we go. 
What do we got? Bam. Harold Ramirez, who has been weirdly good. Weirdly good. I picked him up in fantasy and he's been dicking baseballs, except for last week. This dude's got the wrinkly green screen. What's the deal here, internet? I don't understand. One show pack. Give me a diamond. Let me get him. Oh. I like how like all the other dudes are just like chilling. But they told they told uh Renee Pinto, hey man, slap your glove. And this guy, hey man, hold it up to your face. I don't know. Not a fan. Silver pack, give me something hot. Bam! It's a silver. Well, we've seen it not be a silver before. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, pog champ. Nine ballin' is a habit packs. Give me a diamond. It's Drew Rasmussen. That's not what I'm looking for, baby. But these are all dupes. CJ. At least I can sell pretty much everything. Because I only need the big cards for these last collections. So, yeah. Drew Williams. Golly, man. Give me a diamond. Oh, my God. If you just ask, they, the, the, the gods have blessed me. It's purple. Be Tatis. Be Tatis. Not some other crapper. But Tatis. Padres. Show me. Are you expensive still? You were expensive. Oh. Oh, you cheat now you little bitch ah you suck <laughs> i saw a padres uniform i'm not gonna lie i went i went full-on stiffy i i i i was effing excited it's what the hell i was i was excited champ four four ball and packs remain maybe i shouldn't leave the menu after pulling a diamond maybe that's what i'm doing maybe i'm resetting the pack lock you know what i mean because like now i'm pulling gold i've done that twice after pulling diamonds Am I screwing myself? Joe Ryan. He's pretty grody. Come on, ballin'. Give me something. Daddy's sad. Daddy's gonna cry. Jorge Mateo has been absolutely disgusting. He could be a player of the month card. He's been gross. Um, I don't remember what this it's it's the you get a bat skin with the scouting report and four player items. I don't know what the odds are on these things because it just says that. Oh, here it is. One in 25 that you get a diamond. So I'm definitely not getting a diamond. And honestly, I'm probably not getting a gold. Uh, but there's the odds on that. The way to get this pack, by the way, internet, is you have to sign up for the scouting report via the MLB The Show website. It's just an email thing. You just literally sign up with an email. And I've never paid attention to the scouting report email, but I get these every month. You get one every month. So do it, you know, with your, do it. Thank you. All right, here we go. Let's open it. April scouting report. There's my basket. I got excited. I thought maybe it was gonna be something. I'm gonna cry. All right, we got Hunter Green, yay! And we got a wrinkly ass green screen. I don't see this burgundy green screen, or this burgundy screen, all wrinkly. Don't see the gray one. I see a lot of fucking wrinkles in the green one, though. Uh, we're gonna come back to that. Diamond duos, come on, baby. These have been ass for me, and they're gonna continue it, I think. I don't think I've ever had a good diamond duo pack. I saw the blue right here, and even though I flipped, I thought maybe it was a diamond, and it, it baited me. I wish there were wrinkles in that, in that screen right there. I'm upset. More diamond duo action. What do we got? Bam. Tyrone Taylor. Honestly, kind of a cool card art. Owen Miller. Good Lord. You can see how white his teeth are from this photo. Look at those two. Look at them fucking chompers. All right. Was the last card I got Dominic Smith? Man, I love Dominic Smith. I, 2020 when he was like breaking out. Oh, shit. Let me finish. When I thought Dominic Smith, I like Dominic Smith. Okay. I like his cards over the show. He had an 88 that they gave us at the beginning of the year in one of the one of the one of the seasons, and he was incredible. I loved him. He parallel fived him. He's fantastic. Anyway, take me. It's purple. Please be Tatis. Give me Tatis, please. It's not a Padre. I'm upset. I don't want you. You're ugly. That no, was not very was nice. Just... Luis Castillo, you're not what I was looking for, you bitch. 5k selling at 3k. Oh fuck. Okay, I mean, it's a diamond, you know, it's free stubs, I guess. Oh, 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 it's purple Tatis. Just screaming Tatis, please Tatis, please, please come back to me. Oh my God, it is. This is awesome. I'm selling that bitch too. Man, I'm having a great time. Are you having a good time internet? And I got Marcus Stroman. Okay, cool, whatever. I'm, I'm gonna sell them out. I don't wanna back out. I don't wanna, oh, what the fuck just happened? Random pat, oh, okay. These are from the rolls that you get after you do the XP. Bam, gold, okay. That's not what I was looking for. Come on, that's not what I was looking for either. Come on, give me something fat, give me something juicy. Bam, Luis Renjifo, okay. 
Bam, Chris Sale. Is Chris Sale back? I don't know. I need to, I need to see how he's done. David Robertson and Michael Waka. And then, oh, okay. Uh, okay. Oh my God, a diamond. They were like, oh my God, did we give you Marcelo Zuna? Did that give you heartburn as a Braves fan? Here's a diamond. Oh shit. What the hell are you? Oh, you're gold. I don't, I'm pants on. I can't get up. Gold, baby. Oh, I don't really like you, but yeah. I'll take it. What do you sell for? 31K. Now, let me also say this. I do like, I loved Brandon Webb growing up. Battled by injuries, obviously, but he was really fun. I loved having him franchise mode. I don't think you're worth a shit. It will be the show. Though. I'm going to keep it a buck 50, okay? Maybe you are. Sinker cutter? I don't know. Maybe. Your control's fantastic. Honestly, you might be bitching. Honestly, the break ain't bad either. 77 break on that cutter kind of hurts. 96, 96 K per nine or hit per nine. Mm. I don't know. Maybe we try. Let me know your thoughts about Brandon Webb in the comment section down below. I'll keep him. I won't sell him yet. Uh, more of these. Um, we're getting hot, internet. Matt Strom. Who? I'm going to tell you what. Matt Strom's pissing me off, okay? I've been picking him on the unders for underdog like in all of his starts, and that bitch keeps overperforming, and I don't like it. I won't stand for it. <clears throat> oh, yeah. I got a boss pack, but I already have all these, so uh, I'm just going to sell whoever I take here. Who's actually 27, 26, 27, seven. It's Murakami, right? No, it's Bob Gibson, right? Yeah, Bob Gibson. I got an extra Bob. I'm gonna sell him, buy him, smile. All right. Do we do chase pack or do we around the world? Around the world could be fun. We could get the 99s or we could get base rounds, but like whatever, you know? Five of these, let's do it. Let's jump in. If I hit the rare round on two of them, I'll fucking come. All right, well. All right, we hit the we hit the base round. I think I kind of want to try. I do like big boy Rowdy. I'm not going to lie, but at the same time. Man, Glaber does poop on lefties. I kind of like Xander. Ooh, what do you do? Don't I have Ha Sung Kim? No, I don't. I don't have Ha Sung Kim. Why do I think I have him? I don't know. I don't know if I want him, though. Against righties, he looks significantly worse. At least Bogarts is kind of... I'm going to take Bogarts. I just talked myself into it. Let's go. Around the world. Give me a rare round and make me squeal. Nope. All righty. Well, I tell you what. I done tell you what. That hurt my feelings. We're going to go with... Uh, you know what? I'm going to take Glaber. Yeah? Yeah, let's take Glaber. Let's do it. Around the world again. Give me the rare... Oh. Oh. Heavens be... I have Julio. I got Julio. I'm taking, ooh, I'm taking, I'm taking JT. I don't, Adam Wainwright is 66K. So I'm, yeah, 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 we're gonna take, we're gonna take JT. And I'm gonna be honest with you, I might sell him. I don't know, but I kinda wanna use him. Oh, I don't know. Let me know your thoughts if JT's nasty in the comments as well. I'd love another rare round. Oh, that would have been too nice. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Ah, man, I just can't get behind the bat of Kim. Luzardo doesn't have the pitches I like. Rowdy's kind of a fat boy, and I kind of like it because this is going to blow your mind, internet. I'm fat. So I'm going to take Rowdy. We're going to do it. I don't care. Last around the world pack. Give me something hot, baby. Give me something hot. Damn. That's fine. We can take, uh, you know what? I'll try Luzardo. Who gives a damn? The question is, do I sell these cards or do I keep them? I mean, theoretically, they were free, right? Because they were just, they were XP rerolls. Do I keep them for set one to try to get my second pack to get either Paige or a babe? I don't know. Now, we could get Fernando Tatis. I'm not going to lie. I would love to get this card. Not because I really want to use him. Not because, like, I don't like Tatis or anything. He's fine. But, I mean, listen, I'll find other shortstops I like that actually have quirks. And I'll sell this for 200K all day, every day. Am I going to pull it? Probably not. What are the odds? How do I see odds? One in two chance that it's a diamond, let alone being a good one. Okay. What did we get? It's going to be a gold. Yep. That was a bit of a dick punch, wasn't it? Kind of hurt. Peter Fairbanks. Yay. You're not even a high gold. Not even a gold that might go diamond. Woo. -hoo. Man, I done tell you what, that really sucked right there, internet. That really sucked my spirit out is what it done did. Man, I'll tell you what, I got quite a few of these free agent cards I should go through and clean that out. I'll do that later. 
Um, got a bunch of cards I should clean out actually. Tatis again, we are gonna sell you. I'm gonna put you at three. Wait, 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 wait. Did somebody undercut me? No, nope, that's me. I'm gonna put it the same price. 33, four, nine, four. There you go. Bam. Dude, if I make 60K off that, I mean, I, I can at least buy one of the expensive cards. I could buy DeGrom or I could buy Otani. Shoot. I don't know. I think I could buy Judge. If I, if I clean up my binder and I sell both these Tatises, shoot, I might do that. And then I knock out the AL East. That'd be kind of fun. We could do that. Put our stubs towards something. Believe in ourselves. I'll tell you who I wish I didn't buy was damn Nolan Arenado because he was expensive and he's getting downgraded a million and 10%. If you have an, if you have an Arenado that's sellable, get rid of him right now. Get rid of him. He has been horrible. He has been horrible. He got me negative fantasy points in a week. How the hell do you even do that? He's been bad. Look it up. He's got like a 598 OPS or something. So he's been bad. Take a gander. He's getting downgraded to an 89. Anyway, I am going to go through and clean my binder. I'll do that off cam. Just going to go through and put all the sell orders up. Uh, just real quick checking to make sure I don't have any like diamonds or anything that I could sell anything quick. Uh, oh, we have, do we do have the Luis Castillo? Hell yeah. We got this beautiful card. Three, nine, three, bam. Uh, sure. Why not? Why not? But yeah, I mean, we're getting, we're getting really close to the end of live series collections, which is honestly really cool. I still think it's worth it because the fact that, I mean, these are core cards when, um, when you, you know, when you're doing these collections, you're going to unlock like the Sosa and stuff, which is, that, that's a core card. You can use that at any time, no matter what the sets and all that stuff. So I do like that, but, uh, but we're making really good progress. I feel I'm going to make sure I also sell these Gossmans while they supercharge for sure. Now, some of you guys might be like, man, Gossman could go up 100%. I'm going to be honest with you. I I don't really care. If I lose a little bit of stubs right there, that's totally fine. Again, you guys be smarter than me. If you think somebody's going up and you look at the stats and you're going, yeah, no, it makes sense. Uh, keep him. Keep him and don't don't sell him. So um, I am going to go clean my binder. I hope you enjoyed this video, of course. And dude, on, oh, man. Let me know in the comments. Do I keep Real Muto? Is he is he catcher one? Should we go with some? I mean, he's fast. He's good defensively. He's got a good bat. Honestly, 87 power versus lefties isn't terrible. Or do we go with a different? I don't know. Who's catcher one? Let me know. And then, of course, let me know if I should keep or sell the Kyle Tucker. I bought him for 47K. I'm No, I'm sorry. I bought him for 40K, and he is going for 79. So there's profit there. A, B, there's also a lot of stubs. We can knock out more collection stuff. Let me know your thoughts down below. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.